Then the two of us need look no more. We both found what we were looking for. With a friend to call my own, I'll never be alone. And you, my friend, will see. You've got a friend in me. You've got a friend in me. A summer's disregard, a broken bottle top, and one man's soul. They follow each other on the wind, you know, cause they got no place to go. That's why I want you to know I'm starting with the man in the mirror. I'm asking you to change his ways. And a new message couldn't have been any clearer. If you want to make the world a better place, take a look at yourself and make that change. Disney Coco. Remember me. Though I have to say goodbye, remember me. Don't let it make you cry. For even if I'm far away, I hold you in my heart. I sing a secret song for you. Each night we are apart. Remember me. Though I have to travel far, remember me. Each time you hear a sad guitar, know that I'm with you the only way that I can be. So until you're in my arms again, remember me. Happy Lords, everyone. Um, long night for me, long day. But um, good day, good week. And, um, you know, sorry about um, that note I missed in um, Man in the Mirror, but I'll do better next week. And right now, I'll leave you with a quick thought. Driving. To me, and to most people, driving is a series of small adjustments. Calculated risk-taking and execution of decisions. And by making these decisions from small adjustments, they can save you time and save you from circumstance. The decisions we make when driving are made with the basic skills that we all have. If you have a license, then you, you have all the basic skills of driving a car. But along with those basic skills comes experience, comes style of driving, and comes the circumstances in which you're driving in, because you learn from different circumstances that you're in. In driving, as in life, we all have the basic needs to succeed, to lead a full life, to be there for our families, and to reach the full potential that God has in store for us. Because to me, no matter what's going on, we can always do a little bit better. And I charge all of us, I charge myself, I implore everybody to make small adjustments in yourself. Tweak little things that are going on with you. And continue and always strive to improve upon yourself. Like I tell my better half, you know, I'm trying to polish myself. You know, I'm trying to polish my brain. I'm trying to polish my body. I'm trying to polish my attitude so that I can be better for my kids, better for my wife, better for guys in my job, better for anybody that comes into my path. And I just implore all of us to look in that mirror. And if anybody's perfect, God bless you. But I know most of us aren't. So... Strive for those little improvements. 
Strive for the little adjustments. Strive for those little changes that allow us to make better decisions so that we can empower ourselves and improve on ourselves. I leave you with that. Now let's go to church. <clears throat> joyful, joyful, we adore thee. God of glory, Lord of love. Hearts unfold like flowers before thee, opening to the sun above. Melt the clouds of sin and sadness, give ye more the doubt away. Giver of immortal gladness, fill us with the light of day. You guys have a blessed week. Pray for me as I pray for you. I love you guys. Remember, this week is going to be better. And make those little improvements. Make those little adjustments so that you could strive to your full potential. You guys have a great week. Pray for me as I pray for you. I love you guys. Bless up.